Thunder Bay, Ontario, January the 27th, the staging area for the biggest convoy that the world has ever seen. Count the trucks here, and there are hundreds on the highway already as this gets organized in a way because it has to be organized. The truckers are rolling to Ottawa. Proud to be a part of it. This is Carl from Things That Matter, along with Margaret and Jean, staunch supporters of our group. We are here as an organization to represent and to report and support the truckers who are only asking for one thing. Give us back what you stole. Coming to talk to you, Mr. Prime Minister. Good morning. Just running some video here oh. for Manitoba here. Sorry, I'm from, we're from Calgary. Uh, are they going now? This is uh, being staged from here, yeah. That's what I got uh, talking to uh, one of the trucks in here. This is staging here. They want to do it with trucks and trailers and uh, the bobcats. And then the four wheelers, I guess. They're trying to make some order of assemblance here, so. Yeah, okay. I'm, yeah. All right. And, okay, nice to meet you. There's a guy from Calgary. We've met many people from our old neck of the woods, Ward Winkler area. Canadians coming together to support the truckers because they need you now more than ever. Look at all the names represented, and all the bobtails that are here. This is where it gets real. We're ready to go. The famous words that we all know in NASCAR. Gentlemen, start your engines. That has already begun here. Sorry for the bumpiness. We just uh, This was a, an area that was plowed out for truckers to park. We're going to try and get up as close as we can. Standing for freedom. Amen. Flags of every kind. I think I see my friend Todd McDougal. <laughs> Here he is. <laughs> oh, I almost mistook you for Brandon Burley, but you didn't give me the salute. <laughs> you know, uh, Burley yesterday uh, tweeted um, something hilarious. He said, uh, I take the vaccinated truckers. And I lampooned him on it. He took down the tweet about two hours later. Yeah, hey, Brad, we backed up Burley. <laughs> We're going to call him now Backup Burley. <laughs> hey, wonderful. All right. We are the voice that reports the true North Strong and Free, right, buddy? You better believe it. This is incredible. Yeah, seeing all this, they've got a, they're, they're trying to make it a reasonable assemblance of order, orderliness. <laughs> Look yeah. at this Grand Prairie to Ottawa. We have met so many people from Morden Winkler out here, just bumping into people. And the first question, are you with the convoy? <laughs> yeah. Absolutely. You better believe it. You bet. Hey, there's the Whammobile, nice. That's right. Got it all decked out, we beautiful. Yeah, the support has just been incredible. Can't wait to go see some of the rural communities in between here and Sault Ste. Yeah. It's gonna be amazing, guys. People will be lying on highways again. It's gonna be Are you getting any reports out of the, uh, the road is open again? Because apparently it's closed uh, at White River. We did hear something about that last night. I haven't heard any further on it. Okay. I think so far... The but you know what? They're going to open it up. I mean, they have to keep that road open anyway, so... Well, yeah, and the leader of the convoy would know. And if they're rolling right now and not yep. talking about any issues, it should yeah, be Yeah, exactly. Wonderful. Yeah. All right. That is it for now. I'll keep you posted.